question on an infant versus an adult in terms of the procedures used, the pain felt. Um, and I, I think that's a question that, that people on all sides of the discussion could, could benefit from hearing more details on. Right. That's an excellent question because a neonatal circumcision, in other words, one that's performed in the hospital on day two before, you know, mom, uh, dad, and baby go home, uh, it's done with anesthesia and the child, the best I can tell, they don't remember it and they do very, very well. Whereas there's some cultures, uh, for example, the Filipino culture, uh, you know, who live in daily, uh, a majority, or there's a big proponent that live in daily city, they come in for a ritual circumcision at age, you know, 12 to 14 for religious reasons, and that can be, come, become the defining moment of that kid's life. They're not really thrilled about the whole idea, but of course, with good anesthesia uh, and local pain medicine, they do well. Adults who choose to be circumcised, it's also, I think, much more of an experience that's more defining because they're aware of what's happening, whether they have general anesthesia or what's more typically done after 13 to 14 under local anesthesia.